Hi, in this video we'll be talking about renaming and moving files. Actually, it's the same thing. First, let's create a new folder. So, let's go to our file explorer and on my C drive I create a new folder and let's name it folder A. Now, inside the folder, let's create another empty folder. Now let's name it folder B. Inside folder A, but outside folder B, let's also create a new text document and let's name it file1txt. Okay. What we need is the rename function in the OS module. So now let's go to our IDE and let's import our OS module. Now we want to rename our file1.txt file to new file.txt. So we need the old name which is file1.txt along with the full path if it's not in a current folder. So let's create a variable old equal to and here we need the path. Here is our path. Let's copy it. And we can use a raw string placing an R in front of the quote. And here is our path. And then we have to add the name of our file, which is file1.txt. So this is the old name, and now we need the new name. So we can call the variable new, and let me now copy this. And we want to change this name to new file txt. Okay. And now we need the OS rename function. So the rename function in the OS module, OS rename. And here we pass two arguments, the old name and the new name. Enter. And now the name has been changed. So let's go to our folder to check it out. As you can see, now the name is new file txt. Okay. Now, the next thing we want to do is change this txt extension to docx. So, let's define our old and new variable again. Old equals, now this is our current name. And new equals, and here we want to change this to docx. This extension is used by Microsoft Word, so then we can open the file in Microsoft Word. Now let's use the OS rename function again, with old and new as parameters. Enter. Now let's check it out. As you can see, this file has now changed the extension to docx, and here we can see that it's recognized as a Microsoft Word file. Okay. Now, the next thing we want to do is move this file to folder B. And moving files is very much like renaming them. So, let's define our old variable as, here we have the path. So, this is our current path of this file. And the new path of this file should be very much the same, but the difference is that here we have to add one more level of nesting and this should be folder B. So now this file will be just moved and placed in folder B. Okay? And we use the same function, rename old new 
Enter. And now the file is no longer here. It's been moved to folder B. Here we have it. Okay, that's it for this video. If you like it, a thumbs up would be great. Also, make sure to subscribe for future videos. If you want to leave a comment or ask a question, you're welcome to do so. Thanks for watching.